Hey guys, this is Brianna and welcome back to my channel. I am so happy to have you back um, with me today and I am so excited to be sharing with you this amazing haul that I got from Facebook Marketplace um, for $20. $20. So if you would like to know what I got for $20 from Facebook Marketplace, stick around. Um, and before we get into it, go ahead and hit that like button if you like videos like this. And don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell, so you will be notified when I do other videos like this and upload them. Alright, so let's go ahead and get into this. So here is the bag. I have it in. It's very heavy, as you can tell from me holding it. I can't hardly hold it up to show you all because it's so big and so heavy. The bag I did not get. I already had that bag. So I um, don't normally buy my books from Facebook Marketplace. Um, this is kind of new for me, but I will every now and then get on there and just search for books just to see what's out there. Um, most of the time it's like lots of books um, that have like they're sold by the lot and it's just a mixture and I don't really like buying a lot of books a lot of, I like buying a lot of books but I don't like buying lots of books that are all mixed together uh, so because I'll end up getting books that I don't really like and then I just have to give them away or sell them to somebody else um, but I do really enjoy when somebody has loved a whole set of books and is ready to pass them on and then I am able to collect that whole set so that's kind of what I've done today and I'm super excited about this because this is a set that I um, have not had and wanted to get into okay, so without further ado let's see what it is so I got seven books in here um, and they were all $20 all together so here we go so the first book that I got um, is I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you all so all seven of them are Cassandra Clare books, um, but not all seven are Mortal Instruments, and I'll tell you more about that in a minute. So the first book is City of Bones uh, by Cassandra Clare, and that is book one in the Mortal Instruments series. Um, so it is paperback, and eventually I feel like I'm going to want to get this set all in hard hardcover. Um, because, I mean, I, I like both. I like paper book and hardcover, but I like having a whole set in either paperback or hardcover. And now I have part of the set in paperback and hardcover, and that kind of bugs me that I have both. So eventually I'll probably get this in hardcover, but I'm excited to be able to have the whole set now to be able to read them. My last video, yeah, in my last video, which was the unboxing, um, the Beacon Book Box unboxing for August, which you can check out um, by hitting this card. Um, I mentioned that because there's an item in there that was a Cassandra Clare quote and I had no idea what book it was from. Um, I think I even said the quote wrong. Oops. Um, but I'm excited to be able to actually read Cassandra Clare. I did read this book when I was a freshman in high school. Um, I think I read the whole thing. It's been so long I can't remember. Um, but I did read it in high school and I enjoyed it and I have liked kind of the TV shows and movies that have come out since then about it. Um, but I never went further than the first book. So. And I was really thinking about when this book came out, thinking about how I did read it when I was like a freshman in high school. And as I was flipping through this book, this caught my eye. It's hilarious. You're going to love this. So I saw this in the back of the book. I don't know if you can see it. Um, but it, at the bottom... So it's this band, Honor Society, which I'm not really familiar with. But at the bottom, it has their website, and it's myspace.com slash honor society. And that just cracked me up. It's like MySpace. Oh. So that was book one. <clears throat> we also got book two. So here's book two. This one's definitely in better shape than book one. I think book one was loved very much by the person who had these before me. Um, and it, this one is also in paperback. So there's that. Beautiful covers very beautiful flip through the pages nothing written in them no pages torn very good condition we also have book three in paperback there's city of glass spine back and some beautiful pages all intact and then we get to book four and it is hardcover so book four is hardcover this is another gorgeous cover city of fallen angels 
I love these covers. They're so shiny and so beautiful. There's the spine. I'll take off the cover so you can see what it looks like. So it is plain black and has orange foil lettering that matches the orange foil shiny looking cover. So I'll put that back on. So that was book four. I also got book five. So here's book five, City of Lost Souls. The spine and the back and all of the pages intact. These were in super, besides the first book, which is a little dingy looking, um, the rest of them have all been very good condition. So here's what this City of Lost Souls looks like without the cover. Black with red foiling and all of these pages are intact as well. Very cool. Book six, which is the last book in the Mortal Instruments series. Now guys, this is the treasure from the whole haul. This one is the one that I got most excited for and this is the one that I felt was totally worth the $20 that I paid. So it does look like it was a, it has a Walmart sticker on it. So I'm sure it was purchased from Walmart um, when it was released. When was this one released? I'm gonna look at the copy right and see. When it was published so this one was published in 2014 so it's been a little bit um and it does have a walmart sticker on it and it has a price of 17.49 which seemed to be like a markdown um from like normal regular retail price and on this front it has a sticker that says walmart exclusive free poster so there's that and i don't normally i'm not a fan of stickers on books so i'll probably try to remove those gently may have to use a little goo gone or something to get all the stickiness off but um so if you have any tips or tricks about getting stickers off of dust jackets or books that would be super handy and you're definitely welcome to drop that in the comments below to help me out with that because i definitely want to take those stickers off but i saw that sticker about the free poster sign and i figured okay so this was published 2014 six years ago um what are the chances of the poster still being inside so that was what i was thinking so this book is all of the pages are intact very good condition and if we flip to the back of the book the poster is still there still folded neatly no bins no rips no tears in this poster so there it is so there's the poster in the back of the book the end is also the beginning that is beautiful and I'm super excited that that's in there. But wait, that's not all. This was even advertised on this and I didn't know it until I was looking for the poster that when you take, so here's what the book looks like without the dust jackets, black with silver foil lettering. But here you go, are you ready for this guys? Are you ready? Reversible dust jacket. Look at that. That is my first reversible dust jacket, actually, of any book that I've ever had. And I got it from Facebook Marketplace for $20, guys. So this whole haul was $20 from Facebook Marketplace. Makes me wonder if this person knew the treasures that they had. No, I think some people do. I think some people enjoy a series um, as long as they can, and then they're ready to pass it on to somebody. And that somebody was me this time, and I am super grateful for that. So that was super gorgeous. I'm super excited to um, revisit this world, uh, the world of the mortal instruments, and I'm just very happy with this. There's still one more book, guys. At the beginning, I think I told you I got seven books. That's only six. Mama. Yes? Amina, that thing that happened, we asked you why is it in there? We had a crown in it. Why is it in there? Because we had a crown inside. Oh, okay. I wonder what it's for. I wonder if we can color the stickers. I don't know. Maybe. The life of being a mama. All right, guys. So there is one more book, and I'm excited about this one, too. And our last book in this haul is a hardcover copy of The Infernal Devices Book One, Clockwork Angel. So I'm super excited about this, too, because... Um, 
once I'm finished with Mortal Instruments, I obviously want to read the Infernal Devices too. So I'm definitely starting my Cassandra Clear collection here with this. I won the the copy of Chain of Gold um, from an Instagram giveaway. So I have that one, but I didn't want to read that one without um, reading the, these series first. So I'm glad that I have these and I can start on them. I'm super excited um, for this amazing haul that I got. Um, if you've ever had an amazing Facebook Marketplace haul, definitely drop that in the comments below. Tell me about it. I'd love to hear it. Um, I definitely think that I'm going to be visiting Facebook Marketplace more often to see what kind of good book deals I can find there. Because um, you never know. We could have a hidden treasure like our reversible dust jacket that I got for book six of the Mortal Instruments, that last book. Um, that truly was the treasure that I was hoping to find. Um, and it was actually an unexpected treasure. I wasn't really expecting that. Um, I honestly, from the pictures that I saw, thought that they were all going to be paperback. Um, and they weren't. So I was super excited about that. And I think this was a great haul. Um, but thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this haul. Um, if you do like videos like this, if you enjoyed this video, definitely hit that like button. If you like um, other book-ish videos, um, definitely hit the subscribe button and hit the bell. Um, I love to post unboxings for book boxes, which I will be getting a new book box um, coming up in the next couple of months. Um, normally I do Beacon, but I have decided to add another book box to my subscription. Um, so I'll be sharing that in hopefully toward the end of October. Um, thanks for watching guys. See you next time.